Hello, beautiful people, and welcome to Tina's Travels Abroad. Um, feel free to like and subscribe. Well, this is my journey um, from uh, Vienna, Austria, where I was previously to this trip. This is during the times of COVID. <laughs> Uh, this is uh, actually November, the day I'm leaving Vienna. November, I think it's November 7th that I'm leaving. And I flew into Tbilisi, Georgia, which is the capital of Georgia, where I had been before. But I decided, you know, I'm going to leave and go check out the coast of Georgia, uh, which is Batumi. So from Tbilisi... I took a train, this is the train, um, from Tbilisi, it's a five hour, four and a half hour ride on a really, really comfortable train, um, it's very affordable from Tbilisi, and um, very comfortable, and there I am, and I was really surprised at how comfortable and why the windows were with good views, and uh, yeah, so it would, it was actually my first time on the train coming from uh, Tbilisi in Georgia. I was in Georgia in uh, July of this year, 2021, and I spent two months there. And I love the capital uh, city, Tbilisi, uh, but I was looking for somewhere, especially during these COVID times where everything is unexpected. So I wanted to go somewhere coastal. I'm a beach girl, so this was gonna be a good fit for me. So here I am, I arrived in Batumi, and Georgia is very affordable. It's a very affordable country with a high quality of living. Um, so I said four hours, but it actually was four and a half hours. And you can get, I, you know, I called a boat taxi, which is kind of like the Uber. It was like it maybe a $3, um, two or $3 ride to my hotel apartment. And that's where I arrived that day. That's my hotel apartment, the round building, the white and, and black round building. And this is... When I'm checking in, it's very, very luxurious apartment. Uh, so the hotel is from the 1st to the 10th floor. And then from the 11th floor to the 25th floor, those are um, residential apartments, which is, which is where I'm staying in a residential apartment. This is a beautiful lobby where you can do, um, you can actually use as your, you know, co-office space if you want to. Also to the right of the check-in desk is uh, a beautiful hotel, I mean, excuse me, beautiful restaurant uh, and beautiful inside and the food is good, a Georgian style restaurant, but it has also other foods. Obviously, this is the hallway uh, to my apartment, very clean, very warm uh, and uh, very spacious, as you can see. And this is my apartment. And I didn't really show my apartment because I was going to save that for another video. But this is from my balcony of the views. The ocean is to the right. Ocean. Can't really see it because it was dark, of course. But there's a long boardwalk that's just amazing. Um, that just stretches for miles and miles with lots of things to do. Restaurants, also exactly. some amusement park type stuff. Uh, those buildings that are lit up, those are hotels and also apartments as well. So much new construction going up because, and as you can see, this is a beautiful view and there's the ocean. I can, I get a very good sunset and sun, sunrise that I can see from my balcony. It's a pebble beach and this is the Black Sea is pretty warm. And of course, that's me. And I was surprised that the, the weather in Batumi is quite mild. It's not very cold. And this is, like I said, this is November. Uh, the second week of November, I, I, well, the first week of November, like November 5th or 6th. But uh, as I'm uploading this video, uh, it, a week has passed and it's still quite warm. Uh, not warm, but as you can see, I'm wearing a jean jacket. It's not very cold. So the weather goes up and down. It's not as rainy as I thought I was told it was going to be. Um, but it has a, it's the Black Sea, so it's more of Mediterranean, so it's not really cold. I would say the temperatures get between, uh, I think the coldest has been about 50 to 57 degrees, so that would be maybe like 11 Celsius or something like that, 12. 
um, but the hottest is like 61 degrees, um, something like that. So I would say 16 or 17. But these are my the views from my, my balcony of my apartment. And it's so much to do in Georgia. There's the mountains, as you can see far away. This is a the the harbor, which is at the end of the boardwalk. So there's, you know, this is not the summer season, the high season, so it's not that crowded. But as you can tell here, there's a lot of things to do. But you can also cross over on the other side uh, of the Black Sea, and you can do a lot of um, greenery stuff, like, you know, nature hiking there's waterfalls just uh, there's some sandy beaches on that side because the beach that is here uh, that's right this one that we're <laughs> i'm looking at and you're looking at is a pebbled beach meaning there instead of sand there's you know little mini rocks but it's not so bad it's very comfortable but yeah so this is i made it so you know with all the different things that's happening around the U.S. and also around Europe. Uh, not so much right now, but I've heard, I, you know, as I left Austria, I didn't know this was going to happen. But uh, right after I arrived here, um, they actually, the next two days later, they went on a, a lockdown, you know. So it's the only European country that so far is on a lockdown. But I hear uh, other countries are trying to make more restrictions. So I kind of left Austria in the nick of time. But the reason why I left there is because I just wanted to be somewhere where I, pe I felt like the, it was just the people are just more much more open and friendly. And uh, Georgians are very friendly. The food is good. It, like I said, it's a f affordable country. Uh, so you won't break the bank. And the climate is great. Uh, the statue is really interesting. Uh, they slowly come into each other. I like this, but it's so much to do. But the area by the beach and all the new high rises that's going up because it's becoming more and more of a touristy area. So this is called New Batumi, but they also have the old European style part of town called Old Batumi. And it's just as amazing. Uh, so I haven't even discovered there yet because, you know, it's just so much to do in this area. And and see, I'm zooming in. That's the mountain. There's also a ski. You can go skiing and hiking. So you get the best of both worlds here in Batumi, Georgia. It's very, very, just so undiscovered. Well, not really undiscovered. But, you know, there's a sun, sun setting. Um, you know, yes, the sun is setting here. And I get to see this, um, you know, every day if I'd like. So, um, yeah. Enjoy the view and enjoy the set suns as it sets. So thank you for watching and uh, stay tuned for my live. I'm having a Q&A live on traveling Europe and those who are interested in moving abroad. So hopefully um, if you're interested in moving abroad, feel free to tune in to my live. Okay. okay. Thanks for watching and enjoy the sun setting. Bye.